So what we're doing here is we just made a little stop at the um, farmer's market here in town. Because we had found... We found tamales, spinach and onion, Ooh. and a cactus. 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 Yeah. So yeah, we were going to try those. Um, what is this one? Spinach and onion? Yeah, what do you... So what do you have? Spinach and onion. Sweet! I want to try the same thing. Oh, are you spitting? I just spit everywhere. Burrito? You can. It smells like a tamale. That's delicious. It's really good. It's stupid good. Dang. Oh my gosh. I haven't even gotten to like the deep inner yet. Mm -hmm. Have you gotten the salsa? No. The salsa's even better. It's so good. Oh yeah. That's the cactus one. Mm -hmm. Does it smell like cactus? It smells different. Have you ever had cactus before? It's been a long time. I don't think I have. So you can see the cactus. It just looks like a bell pepper in there. Is the green sauce in here so? This is good. It's good. It's very different. That's the only way I can describe it. Because I've never had cactus before. So the flavor of cactus is very different to me. But you like it because it's gone. It's gone. So good. Okay, now that uh oh, go down. My belly is full of tamales. Um, I can kind of update you guys on how I'm feeling today. So, y'all know that I've been kind of sick. Well, allergies, kind of sick. The last it was last week. Yeah. Um, but before that, I told you guys that my anxiety was high, specifically because of some kind of pressure that I've had in my ear. Um, I still have it, and it's on and off, but it's like this weird fullness in my ear, like my earway is blocked, but it's not. So, I have that again this morning, and it was sucky because <laughs> we have a, I know, it's a beautiful Saturday, it's actually chilly, um, we've got plans this weekend, and then this showed up as, basically as I was waking up this morning. But I finished my workout, which I'm really proud of. So, yeah, I, are you proud of me? Proud. You proud? And you gotta eat tamales. Yeah, and then we had tamales, and we had a nice conversation at the gym. Several um, of them. Okay. So, this is one of those times because I know that this isn't—it doesn't physically hurt. It's just really annoying and makes my anxiety bad, and it kind of throws off my balance because we can't hear out of one ear. Then balance it's off. So I was like this close to saying let's just not go but I'm glad I did. So there, that the only point to this little clip is to tell you guys that perseverance. Perseverance. And persevere and you get vegan tamales after. There you go. So that's that. But we're gonna go have a nice rest of the day. I think so. Yeah. Yeah and then climbing tomorrow. I think so. <laughs> we stop. Just let me poke your bed. <laughs> That's weird. It's too late. It's too late, boy. Too late. <laughs> no. Yeah. No. Too late. Get back, woman. <laughs> You're just gonna poke it. No, don't poke my bread. It's fine. I got plenty of good bread to poke right here. <laughs> 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 Go eat your holy bread. You can go in the bedroom, the bathroom? That's weird. <laughs> Stop it! <laughs> <laughs> so, guys, so it's Sunday and we've got a really fun day planned. I'm gonna show you all a full day of eating. I'm so excited about where we're going for lunch right now. Matt and I are watching. Uh, we're getting caught up on The Walking Dead, so we're on season four. 
and I know that they're showing season 7. I already know what happens in season 7, so you don't have to spoil it for me. But we're going to watch that, and then we're going to go climbing today, and then we're going to go to Bolden Creek, which is one of my new favorite restaurants of all time. So, hope you guys enjoy this little full day of eating within this week's series update. So, starting out breakfast this morning, I've got my coffee with um, cashew milk. I've got some vitamins right there. i got some water. Protein sludge. And then we're going to make a stop on the way to the rock gym and I will show you guys what we're going to have there. So we'll Okay, see well, soon. where were we going to go? Because we're not going to go anymore. <laughs> so I found out recently Just toast sticks from Burger King are vegan. And then, like, basically fries and hash browns and all that kind of stuff, which he's more of that. But the French toast sticks, I love. I love French toast. Uh, we were going to go get them, but it's 10, so we need to head to the rock gym. Um, so instead, I'm going to have this guy on our way, and we're going to go climb. So we will see you, not at Burger King, but at the rock gym. We're gonna get stuff for Thanksgiving because we are making our vegan feast to take to my family's Thanksgiving because they don't like vegans. If you're in my family. Please like us. <laughs> Just like us. I don't know what to say. Get home food. We found so many good things, you guys. We found so many good things. Um, vegan marshmallows. I'm gonna stop saying vegan. You guys know that they're gonna be vegan. Um, marshmallows, eggnog, nog, not eggnog, um, nog, pumpkin pie, our um, garden roast that we were originally going in there for. We're gonna make a green bean casserole to take for Thanksgiving. So I looked up a recipe real quick. It's super simple. What else did we find? We got our diet cheddar yeah. block 
cheese. Oh my gosh. Talk about pie already? Got two of those. I got the pie that we're going to have some tonight. Uh, whipped cream. Pie. Coconut whipped cream. That pie. Yeah, the pie. Half nice. of the pie. And then I'm going to make a pumpkin pie for Thursday, but I just wanted some pumpkin pie tonight. I'm going to go home, probably sleep, dig into pie, and watch Walking Dead. Yep. And that's going to be it for the end of the night. Um, side note, so we are walking around in there, and I saw this guy that I follow on Instagram and YouTube. Um, he's a minimalist, so him and I think his girlfriend or somebody, they live out of an RV. Um, and I had come across his videos whenever we were looking into just reducing our amount of stuff. And he's got a lot of great videos on how to go more minimal with your just amount of stuff. I saw him in there and I was like, oh my gosh, that's the guy that I follow. I didn't want to go up to him just because, I don't know, I just kind of felt kind of weird. But I just thought it was kind of cool to see somebody that you follow online and then you see him in person and you're like, hey, there he is. Anyway, that's him. Matt didn't know who he was, so he was like, okay. It's kind of, kind of weird if I go up to him. <laughs> okay. Like, hey, I don't know you at all. <laughs> but my wife does. Yeah, I hear you're a minimalist. <laughs> Come on, Buzz. Go, Buzz. Go. No, 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 no. Don't, don't get in there. Buzz? He's right there. Buzz? Where? Buzz, he's right there. Hi. <laughs> Buzz, you found me. Buzz, go, 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 go. And he's off. You got a lot. You got a lot of pee. Careful at the car. <laughs> Sounds like a little horse. I'm just gonna leave that. Hi, kitty. Go. Go, kitty. <laughs> Here's the little goodies we got from Whole Foods for the. I'm gonna make green bean casserole. So there's that. There's our oh, pumpkin pie. I'm so excited. Our uh, marshmallows. Coconut whipped cream. I saw this. Interesting. Thought this was very interesting. Not gonna eat that tonight, but sometime. This is what we're going to have on Thursday for Thanksgiving, and it's enough for eight, so this is going to last us my family dinner and Matt's family dinner, so almond milk nog. The, uh, I saw a lady at the store that said that try, she tried this and um, said it was amazing, so the macros on it, too. Half fat, nine carbs, one protein, so as far as, like, eggnog goes, um, this is way better for you guys, so... Definitely give this a try. Um, I can say that without even trying it because I know this is going to be good. And then our favorite, favorite cheeses. Had to get two of these. I don't know when we're going to use them, but had to get two. So yeah, I'm going to put this stuff away. We're just right here. Does that work? So you could be here too. Does that work? Come here. What? Oh my gosh. Smell them. When was the last time you had a marshmallow? Oh my. I haven't had marshmallows in over a year. It tastes like marshmallows. It's my I'm so excited. You can buy them online, but I just I'm haven't. Really them. I haven't really tried to buy them, but because it hasn't been cold, I like marshmallows whenever it's cold. Oh my gosh, you guys, these are oh, yeah. delicious. And there's no gelatin in them. You guys are wondering. They're a little creamier too, a little thick. Yeah. These are really good. Mm. Google gelatin. I can almost guarantee that you won't want to eat regular marshmallows ever again. Just saying. These are really good. Oh my gosh. These are freaking delicious! Why did I not buy the giant ones? Oh! Were there giant ones? Yeah. Yeah, look at a bar. Find these, buy them. You're welcome. a serving of these while we were watching The Walking Dead. Right now I'm making dinner, which is going to be some brown rice, zucchini cooking in the air fryer. Hey. <laughs> Your hair looked like it was from the 90s. Say tan that I made. Not sure what else. And Matt is having healthiest vegan dinner ever. Oh. Oh. Uh. Wonder how that's going to be. You Shake. Good boy. Can you 
shake. Other hand. Other hand. No. Nope. Other hand, oh. Buzz. Stay. And then the cake flip off. So I actually had some rice left over from the uh, mushroom garlic rice that I made with the seitan. So I've got my seitan rice zucchini. And then for dessert, protein sludge with these, of course, marshmallows. Right, Buzz. Girl, you're so cute. <laughs> I did it upside down. <laughs> oh man, you made that look not good. <laughs> what the heck? This is why I'm not on YouTube. Uh, <laughs> that food presentation. That could be the thumbnail. Boom. <laughs> what vegans eat. <laughs>